Okay, we're with Betty Captain, Hannah, Vizio, Adam the goalkeeper. Hannah, what did you think of the game today? It was a stressful game, if I'm honest. The first half, I just thought, we never, we're not going to come back from this, but then we came out after half-time and it was a t different team. Different team. Adam, what, what did you feel about the goal that you conceded? Sloppy. Uh, on my upper half as well. Um, probably should have stepped across and claimed it, but I don't think a ball like that should be coming into the box. But that was we won the game, didn't we? we? Got three points, so just happy to have three points in the bag. Betty, what changed for you in the second half? Oh, second half, everyone taking the responsibility for their jobs and everything. That could have started for me as well. Did uh, second to the man, did the tackles, headers, winning the seconds as well. Everyone picked up and did what we were told to do. Well, first half, we didn't do it, and obviously it got to us as well. They scored from it. Hands up as well. From the goal as well. I ran in trying to do some tackles and they put the ball behind me. My man crossed the ball in. It scored. Put the ball in and scored and they scored from there. So partially my fault. It's still a team game, so we all we fought for that. And a big improvement from the two all just a few just a week or so ago. Yeah, it was. I'm, I, we definitely deserved the win. I think we're the better team overall. I just thought we could have made it much more easy for ourselves. Oh, absolutely, absolutely. Adam, you've only been with us for a few weeks. Yeah. Um, what's it like being amongst the boys? Yeah, no, I love it. I, I know a few of the boys when I was at Burnham anyway. I played against basically everyone that's in this club. Um, it's a different different experience. It's nice. Yeah, it's just happy to be here, isn't it? That made you feel welcome? Yeah, of course, massively. I knew George and Andy from uh, college. Cliff, I knew. Betty I knew anyway, so yeah, yeah, it's, it's always a nice welcome when you know people in the club. And yeah, the rest of the boys, likes of Hazy and that have welcomed me nicely. So slightly controversial question. Did you expect to displace Matt Walker as quickly as you have? It's one of them ones, it's not my decision to make. I just bided my time and leave them leave them decisions up to the gaffer. So Betty, we're still in with a shout to yep. get the title. Yeah. How does it feel knowing that um, just a few days yeah. time? Hashtag United Club and so now. Oh, a bit nervous. Because we all probably were watching on Twitter, Instagram, whatever it is. We're watching, trying to find out if they should win or not. If they do win, obviously, better luck to them, you know. It's their day, their season, maybe, maybe it wasn't for us. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? You see that? You see that? Hey, do you see that? Mate, oh, just oh, quickly, it. we was just looking for the ball boys. They was here first half, <laughs> then they went second half. Man. <laughs> yeah, off you go, off you go. There you go, you see that? But yeah, I think if they win on Tuesday, it's, it's hard to them because they work hard. They work hard for it and they've got their one. Because you work hard, you deserve to, yeah. you know? So I think they deserve it if they do win. Hanno, if, we, um, if everything is sewn up, is it hard to motivate the guys when they don't have so much to play for? I think they come and play and they want to enjoy it anyway, no matter what. So I feel like they're motivated if we've got the promotion to go for, or if not. Hmm? Fantastic. Adam, um, what do you feel going into the last few games of the season? Would you like to stay in the team? Obviously, you must want to stay in the team. I'd love to be like cement a position in this club, but it's competition with walks so it's always nice to have competition and uh just see what happens don't we i miss i'm not i'm away for the last two games anyway uh, so uh, okay. Ooh, I <laughs> controversial <laughs> but I hopefully i play in the last two games before i go away but oh. betty last word for you see you later moving, bud. moving into the next game mm -hmm. what are your feelings feelings mm. well I'm, I'm confident in my team my teammates if we do do our job right from the start but it's sometimes like a cup final on tuesday it's a very very big everyone needs to stand uh turn up and be counted for it as well from the what from the bench from the uh, our manager getting the team right our players mindset from work straight there like you know what I mean everyone needs to be on it from the start from kickoff even before warm up everyone needs to be ready because in the, the day we need to get them on the three points no matter what hashtag uh, results are we need to win our game concentrate on our game one game at a time we need to win it real captain space there for Betty thank you guys very much for the interview Thanks. thank you you see this Betty <laughs> Betty's always looking handsome, oh, as know. always. Remember, me and Frenchie, who's the handsome? <laughs> you guys vote on it. Put on the Twitter, yeah? Let's see who's that good looking one. Look at him, the spotty guy and the black sexy man. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>